Hi guys, this is Eva from Bay Arbor Med Spa and today I'm going to give you a live demonstration. How lucky are you all out there that you will be able to get a live demonstration of laser hair removal on a female's uh, chin and neck and upper lip. Uh, this is a friend of mine uh, that I know for a while. We have done already quite a few treatments, had a lot of hair on the chin, on the neck, on the upper lip, and we see each other every five weeks uh, to do laser hair removal. And she was kind enough uh, to let me make a video with her so that you guys can know that this is a real thing. I'm showing you a real thing, how laser hair removal is done on a dark pigmented skin. So I'm going to go now, going to start doing the treatment. You guys won't see me. You might hear me and you might just look some, see my gesticulation, you know, because I am working. I can't pay attention to you guys. So you will just see me, but uh, I'm going to turn around now. And I think, I think, yes, you can see. So um, my friend has, uh, some hairs on the chin, on the neck. So uh, first of all, we have to remove it. And the way we remove it is, uh, her hair is so little that she doesn't even see it. But as you guys can see, I look through a magnifying glass and I can see the fine hairs. So I'm going simply to shave them off, uh, the fine hairs. And you guys are going uh, to see what I do. So I think you can see, yeah. So I'm just shaving off the hairs because when you do laser hair removal, you cannot have any hair on the skin. Otherwise it defeats the purpose. Okay, we did that. We will go on to clean it. Now, before we continue, I'm going to ice the area. So I use ice packs. And uh, I want to tell all of you out there, guys, you hate me when you come here and I put the ice packs on you. And particularly people that have dark skin, ice has a horrible reaction to, to the skin and it really feels awful on the skin but you will love me the moment I lay laser on you and you will say ice, 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 please because the ice really cools the area, these ice packs. So the pain, uh, the discomfort from the laser is 60, 70, 80% less. So this is, so you hate me right now. She doesn't like me right now by putting this on, but she will like me when I do laser and then cool it because the cooling of the skin actually cools the blood. And so when the laser hits it, the blood is cooler. So the heat is the one that actually hurts. It won't hurt as much. So here is, we did that. I'm going to put a gel, a numbing gel on the skin. So it has a little numbing cream. Not that it makes a lot, but it cools it uh, a little bit. And uh, I am able to see uh, where I passed already so here we go I'm going to show you uh, we start and guys this is live demonstration and this is not a doll she's a real human being so and she's alive uh, so if she doesn't move it's because she has high tolerance to discomfort but I guess it's maybe not so painful anymore, right? Right. So you see, it's relatively fast. And okay, guys, it looks very easy because she has very few hair, little bit of hair left. But if somebody came with, you know, hormonal disturbance, a lot of hairs, it does hurt. It is not a picnic, but it is worth it because she also had a lot of hair before, not that much, but still much more than now because we are already more than half done and it hurt at the beginning. But now because the hair is so little and sporadically placed, 
that the discomfort is very little in the eyes and the tip of this machine. See here, the, there is a refrigerant. This is ice cold, this. So when I go over the skin, that also helps to cool uh, the skin and the, the temperature of the skin. So here we are. It's not the end of the world. It's uh, very doable. And my God, what a difference it makes in a person's life for a woman, self-confidence, walking straight forward, a, not being embarrassed that everybody is looking at you hair, chin chin or neck hair. So it makes a big difference. Okay, some eyes. Okay, I'm going to show you uh, how we do the upper lip. We have a little bit of hair. So I'm going to do the upper lip. Uh, I use this dental gas rolls that we are going to put in the mouth. And the reason that I do this is to protect the teeth. Because remember, thank you. Remember the the laser is hot. It's 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 heat and light. So the laser is hot. So we don't want the heat uh, to hit the teeth. So we put these uh, cotton rolls in there to protect to make a barrier between uh, the teeth and the lip. So I'm trying to cool this. Now, if you ask me which part of the body hurts the most on a face, on a woman's face, it's the upper lip. The upper lip hurts the most to the laser because you cross nerves in the middle. So it's painful, it's sensitive. But who wants a moustache? Nobody wants a moustache. So when we don't want the moustache, we want to get rid of it. We will do, and we women will do, and take the pain until we get rid of the, uh, of the hair that we have on the moustache or on the chin or on the face or on the side parts. Jeanette, can you hold it a second? Mm -hmm. Thank you. You see, she's moving. She's alive. <laughs> OK, so I'm going to put a little gel on. And I'm lowering a little bit the setting for the upper lip. Thank you. So it's a numbing cream, uh, a numbing gel that helps a little bit. It cools it, and it shows where I can pass or where I pass because it is light blue. Okay, there we go. Take a deep breath. The part under the nose, guys, hurts the most, so uh, I try to do it as quickly as possible under the nose because it really does hurt. It's very uncomfortable, but nothing we can do about it. You want to get rid of the air? Well, we do it. Okay. Deep breath. Did I miss anywhere here? Anywhere? Here. Okay. Now we are going to do the sideburns. So there is some hair here, so we have to shave it off. Can we see the other side? Okay. Yes, guys, we always have to shave the hairs because we cannot have hairs on the surface. So I'm going to cool this area. I'm putting the cooling gel. Okay. 
I have a little bit of jar in my hand. Okay. Okay. So here we go. She only has like three hairs here, so you'll be able to see. And if you saw the smoke, it was a little hair, and when laser sees the hair, mm -hmm. we have to, it burns it, that's why we have to shave it, because it goes up uh, and it burns it, so you see the smoke here. So guys, this is the live demonstration of facial hair, chin hair, and upper lip. I thank you for watching. I thank my friend here for letting me do it. And until next time, thank you. Ciao, Eva.